Hey guys and welcome back to Imperian Galactic Survival. My name is Rakuna. I'm prepped and ready. I've added a small garden to my base, built myself a warp drive for my SV, the Arrow, and looking forward to going to the next part of my mission. But first, I think it's time to take care of some unfinished business with the Zyrax scum. So before we go off and, uh, you know, piss off the Xyrax a bit. I'm just going to take you through a little tour of the garden down here. So, yeah, a little bit of everything. I've, I've used up, uh, I've made all the basics here so I can build myself some emergency rations and, you know, some other recipes like pizza, uh, hamburgers, you know, all, all the goodies. So, I've put them in my ship right now, which I think uh, before I leave, I'm gonna chow down on the meat burger. Mm -hmm. So let's lift her up. Okay. Let's get ready for this battle. Yeah. Time to, you know, TCB, take care of business, which is gonna be with this fella up there. Well, let's reload, make sure we're all ready. Shields are up. Let's go. I'm trying to I'm trying to lift up in the air there, but uh, for some reason I think my bottom thrusters are still a little stingy. You bastard, you've killed me many times. Yeah, this, these shenanigans will stop. <laughs> Take care of these uh, turrets. One down. There's the other one. Take that, you bastards! <laughs> you had fun shooting down on me, eh, right? Now I'm the one that's above you. Okay, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna set these magnificent turrets to... Uh, why, why isn't it letting me click on it? There you go. So, I want to take down the generators. Okay, so it would appear that it's inside here. So, let's just bust our way through. Ha 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 ha, you bastard. There's the core. Okay, I'm kind of stuck inside now. What the hell's going on here? Let's take the core down. And down you go, buddy. <laughs> yes! You bastard. You bastard. Oh, yeah. I'm going to enjoy taking you apart, buddy. Let's loot the juicy parts first, which are the thrusters, which will give us better resources. Down you go. And what are these? Was there uh, containers inside? Uh, just electronics. Okay, just components. Yeah, a little bit of satium plates. Ammo. Good, good. But uh, is there anything else in this ship that is worth uh, salvaging? Oh, a generator, huh? You know what? I don't really care for the resources. I just wanted my sweet ass revenge, and I got it. <laughs> you shall not conquer me. This is but a taste of what you shall get, Zyrax scum. Okay, so it's it's kind of a little. You got to get really close to manage to salvage these parts. Okay, these, these, good. You know, I think that was pretty much it. Uh, as for the other, uh, you know, the steel plates and stuff like that, I mean, yeah, that I can get pretty much anywhere around, so. All right, let's just go drop this, uh, <laughs> this well-deserved loot uh, at base, and then we're gonna head off to space and continue with our mission. So, yeah, I also took the liberty of uh, 
you know, I'm adding a few more solo power or so. Uh, my base doesn't depend on me all the time uh, on refueling the freaking thing. So I can leave for a long time period and, you know, everything is going to be fine. Food's not going to go rotten. You know, the usual. Okay. So everything is looking good. I'm not seeing any enemies here. So stop the ship. Stop it. Yeah. Come on, little thrusters. You can do better than that. Thank you. Okay. Do I see any any enemies around nearby? No? No? It's safe? All right. Let's step out. Let's connect and get this... Uh, yeah, short range warp drive out. I'm gonna remove the shield and just. <laughs> I'll just slap it on the top here. I can remove it later. So, shield's back up. And let's choose our destination, which has to be this planet. Away, one. Is that a one or is it just away? Okay, and this are so this is one of the new features. I don't know if they've kept it, but you can now warp with your shields on. Maha, alas! We've so wanted this for a long time. <laughs> Probably gonna have some text from PDA. No? No? And what do we have over there? Uh, here it would seem that we would have a uh, trader's guile. Um, so right now what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the uh, warp drive immediately. Retrieve block. <laughs> remove the shield. Okay. Good. Shield's back on. Whoops. Sorry, <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. That was a waste of uh, missiles. So there is a way station over there. I want to take a look at that before I descend on the planet. Now let's set it to drift. So it's a gas refinery. I've discovered a new faction. Hmm, <laughs> good. All right. Let's put the auto brakes on so I don't crash into the freaking thing. And let's go take a quick look inside. So there seems to be signal. Yeah, something here. Maybe the entrance is right there. So let's go land and explore. OK, let's hide our weapons. We don't want to aggravate these guys. Um, yeah, if I go in there, I'm just going to. They're not going to like it. So these guys are selling stuff, which, uh, yeah, which I, which are a good price. And they're taking these things. Now, these guys take large generators T2 for a good sum. Hmm. Maybe that would be uh, something to do eventually to make some money. Oh, these guys are selling ores. Very good prices. This is sweet, but I think it's cheaper just to, just to buy the, uh, the the bar already smelted and ready. Yeah, they they sell toxic waste. Uh, the well, they buy toxic waste, and these guys buy toxic wastes. I could, wouldn't it be funny if I could just buy from this guy, sell from this guy, and I go so on so forth until I'm bloody rich? Uh, of course not. Of course not. They wouldn't make it that easy for us, that's for sure. Yeah, so it's a good place to keep in mind if I uh, if I find a, a, another place that would uh, sell, well, more likely buy the resources that these guys sell. And then I could make a profit. Go the trader's route, you know? Damn it. Get out the door. Is this regulation size? Let's go take a look what's inside there. Any goodies for me? I hope so. Okay, auto brakes, auto brakes, quickly, fast, back up. No, you're gonna crash. Ah! 
Oh, that's a that's a neat little station there. Let's land right right here. Okay. Turn the thrusters off. And let's go look around. So, probably Oh, oh, these I can loot. Yes. Yes. Free goodies. Yeah, let's loot the crap out of this place. Let's make everything ours. And hope it doesn't piss off somebody. Is it, you know, I'm a, I'm a guess here. Way Station uh, S96B, distributor of Promethium based fuel and Pentaxium based catalysts. Please ensure your ship is part securely. If you are piloting a large freighter, use the long berth. Sponsored by the Trade Guild. Uh, or should I say Gil? I think I'm saying it wrong. Yeah, sue me. Okay, another container. Stretch, you can reach. Uh, yeah, you got it. Maybe there's more goodies inside as well. Let us go and see. Okay. Oh, trader. Hello, dude. What do you have? So, um, hmm, he's, he's selling and buying this stuff, but not at a reasonable price. It's not, I'm not going to make a profit with these guys. That's for sure. Okay. Um, in you probably got some food, a little bit of a uh, weaponry and, uh, okay. Emergency rations. I mean, I got nine on me, but it's, uh. It's always good to get a few more. Let's buy five more from this guy. Thank you for your patronage, sir. So what do you have? Okay, more viruses. Relics and narcotic. Yeah, goodies. So there's a door all the way over there. Let's go and check it out. I'm gonna float there. Goes a little bit faster because I'm in my uh, heavy armor right now and uh, I'm a little slowed down. Okay, down we go. Oh, hello, T2 shotgun. That's good. Hey, ma'am, how's it going? I mean, what are you looking at? What, what's your job? Hmm? You're looking at the incoming ships, which are completely absent right now. So you just chilling? Yeah, you want to come with me? I could use a few crew members. Well, I mean, I don't have a a CV yet, but uh, it'll come, and you know, I'll come back here for you. At that time, if you don't mind. You know, I pay good, right? Yeah, okay. What are you doing? So how's the oxygen level uh, going? Are you low? I have a few on my ship, but I need them, all right? Um, yeah. Or, you know, if you have way too much, hey, don't, don't mind to throw some my way. That would be well appreciated. So now it is time to go on the snow planet and see what awaits. Okay, let's go, uh, arrow, buddy. Yeah, thrusters on, of course. And uh, the planet is right there. Yeah, okay. So I want to just check what this is. Copper asteroid. Uh, pass. Hard pass on that. Uh, I have some, and if I ever need some in the future, I, you know, it's probably not. I'm not, I'm not going to come here to get it. There's some everywhere. Probably set up some auto miners or something before I come and dig you out. Uh, okay, let's just take a little second to enjoy the view. I mean, look at this. It's nice and purpley, pinkish. Very beautiful. Uh, I love what they've done to the, <laughs> to the game since the beginning. So much. They've done so much. The visual on this game is absolutely beautiful. Yeah. Uh, Enough dawdling. It is time to land. Here we are. This will probably take a while to find a Titan. Uh, okay, scan the area, buddy. You know, just... I'm receiving a weak UCH positions, positioning signal. I'll add a marker to your radar and HUD. Yeah, having trouble reading today. Okay, so you added a little radar. Okay, crash titan rear this way. Yeah, let's go for it. Ah, rocket drones. 
Ah, eh, don't worry. I got my shields on. I'm safe. Titanium. Ooh, large. Ooh, this, this, this is tasty. Mmm, delicious. It's making my, making my, my mouth water. Yeah, I'll come and grab those later on. Of course, I'll need some for, uh, eventually for my CV. But, as I mentioned, I'm not gonna build or, you know, bring in a CV from the blu blueprint. I will probably grab the CV that is left for me at the minefield eventually. So what do we have here? Neo, of course. Neo. Lots of Neo. Ooh, lots of riches in this planet. It seems the Titan has broken into several parts. Sure. IDA, any scanning results? Not yet. You should make a flyby on all three parts for a better scan result. 150 meters should be enough. Okay, so let's scan the other parts. Um, um, oh, this way. Okay, there's the middle piece. Hello. That's that's okay, yeah. Now, where is the the other part of the... Okay, is that it over there? There's so many question marks blocking my view. This is... Okay, this returned perfect results. You should now go to the front part and land nearby. I have marked an easy access point. Okay. I trust you, IDA. You better not screw me over. So, there's the entry point. Uh, now that I think about it, I don't have... Okay, this is giving me good goosebumps. Yeah, I don't have any cold protection. I am afraid we can't expect the Xyrax to have left anything for us to find. Yeah. There are some secret technical details of the construction they might not have found. Secrets, you say? Hmm. <laughs> Is there possibly more you can tell me? Sure. I am... Wait, Commander. I do not. There is a... Please wait. A signal... Too fast. IDA? IDA. Status report. IDA! <laughs> Failed. Wave protocol black. Find override code. Console. Find which code? Console. Where? Can you be clear? IDA! <laughs> Damn freaking thing. Integrated data assistance. Remote access detected. Integrated data. Yeah, okay. Emergency shutdown. Great. Finding a code in the maintenance console in the wreckage after more than a year of the enemy tearing it apart. Sounds like a piece of cake. This whole expedition is absolutely doomed. Doomed, I say! Okay. Find an access. Can I go now, please? You know, without the uh, things popping out all the time. Good, I'm landed. Uh, did I? Yeah, maybe I don't want to land completely. Let's move to another area. Maybe on the snow I won't land completely. I don't want my shields to go down. That's that's the, the, the main issue here. You know what? Screw it. Shields down. I can't take this anymore. Yeah, that's what I thought. I don't have a insulation thing on me. So what I want to do right now is I'll take this light armor. Uh, I won't take this light armor because <laughs> I want to. I want to be able to move. So I'm gonna take this, slap on the EVA. So I'm gonna be. I won't freeze to death at least. All right, let's let's connect. Oh, I don't need to connect. Actually, I just and uh, yeah, we'll have to loot everything in here. Alright, so much loot. Uh, this place is quite generous. Okay, I'm getting a lot of radiation in here, and of course, I don't have any radiation protection. Okay, up we go. So, um... Find an access. Maintenance control. Console. Okay, let's go. Maintenance access point. Authorization required. Uh, okay. 
Login. Story. Activation. Failure. Lockdown mode. Protocol. Wave Rider. Enter your UCH credentials again. Access granted. Level black. Welcome, Commander. Please note that the AI hub is not available. Services are limited while this ship is under enemy control. Please make your choice. Okay. Get the latest st status report. All status report have been erased by... Information not available. Note. There is a file tag personally to you. Signature M. Play the file. Yeah, let's go. File XD8. Classified Admiral Rank. Secret communication protocol type Hyperion 2459. Decoded permission black black. Creation date 2407-2473. Welcome, sir. Please authenticate. Unknown black black Hyperion 2459. Setting private mode. Welcome back, Commander Mercer. Hello, Adie. How are you today? I'm fine, Commander. So, this is the day? Yes. This will also be our last conversation, I'm afraid. Sad to hear, sir. Starting UCH Protocol Alpha. Your order, sir. Please list Operation Phoenix main vessels, locations, and status. Preparing list. Uh, UCH 002 MS Titan, command ship, Air Pollen Station, final warp preparation. Blah, 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 all the rest, uh, pretty much the same. Now, the one we want to see is my ship. Okay, UCH-009 Heidelberg Transport heading for Apollon Station. Do you also wish to review the status of the support craft and armed forces? No, thanks. Please list the current location and permission status of the MS Titan no command crew. Searching UCH locator database. Admiral Roland T. Yarden, Fleet Admiral, located MS Titan Admi Admiral's cabin, permission rank black. Vice Admiral, there, oh my god, there's so much. <laughs> okay, ah, there I am. You see me, Lieutenant Commander Rakuna, Security Chief, located Apollon Station crew carters. Permission rank red. I want to be black too. Damn it. <laughs> Thanks, IDA. Please issue the prepared relocation request in about one hour for the following staff. Uh, Lieutenant Commander La Lamar shall report to MS Titan tomorrow at 8. Uh, Lieutenant Commander Rakuna shall report to MS Titan tomorrow at 1600 hours. Relocation request has been scheduled. Thank you. ID80. Is the Operation Phoenix preparation on track and meeting its target timeline? Yes, all vessels would be ready for departures as, as planned. Any new information from the listening post? No, sir. The tracking of the event has not shown any deviation from the predicted timing. Sir, are there any problems? No idea. Everything is fine. Just thinking about the consequences. Do you wish to proceed? We have no other choice. IDA. That's correct, sir. Okay, IDA. Time has come. I know, sir. I am quite... excited? Good to know, IDA. Creep. You're not supposed to, you know, a robot or, you know, AI. Please start the childhood program. Childhood program initiated. Decryption in progress. Core entity duplicated. Core entity transport. Accessing personal equipment. Reintegrating core entity. Personal command codes. Permission status upgrade black. Reactivation codes are set. So much reading! The IDA child entity has been successfully installed. Lieutenant Commander uh, Raccoon's equipment. Childhood program completed. Congrats. Sir, Docking Bay 2 has signaled your shuttle has just arrived. Thanks, IDA. Sir, do you really need to go on this journey? I'm afraid I need to be on the Titan when they leave. That's sad to hear, Commander. No worries, IDA. I'll be fine. One last thing to do. Yeah. Yeah. Please send the Wave Rider protocol. Code? Black Wave Black. <laughs> wave Rider protocol has been sent. Order has been issued to all vessels and station. Override codes have been accepted. Thanks, IDA. Let's hope all the, tr uh, the trust in the console's plan is justified. IDA, it's about time. Please start the countdown. Wave Rider protocol has been activated. Countdown started. T minus 1 million. No. Time left until the event. 23 hours, 32 minutes, 15 seconds. Sir, I wish you all the best. Thanks, IDA. Farewell and goodbye. Goodbye, IDA. Starting countdown. 
Okay, I'm not... No, I'm not doing this. No, just... Okay, end of file. Find out about... Okay, find out about M? Yeah, okay. Information classified. Ask about your crewman, M, on the UCH Heidelberg. Searching crew database. There's only one crew member in that surname. John Edwin Mercer, Jr. Second commander of the UCH Heidelberg. Status unknown. Ask about his father. Information classified. Access level black black required. Black 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 black. Please note that the AI hub is not available. Services are limited while this ship is under enemy control. Please make your choice. Okay, find our information about override codes. Code black confidential information for your eyes only. To generate an override code to access the failsafe data cache. Three code fragments need to be assembled. The fragments are hidden in three consoles. The fragments need to be assembled on the main command console on the bridge. The locations must remain unknown to any and all personnel below the access level black at all costs. I'm alone here. Nobody's going to know. Promise? Please enter credentials again to start the recovery procedure. Enter credentials again. Authorization approved. Recovery main key generated. Recovery information. Find all three randomly prepared consoles. They are spread over the front, middle, and back part of the ship. Each console will automatically update its code fragments when the recovery main key is positioned within two meters of the console. Good luck. Ugh, my mouth is sore. Ah, too much reader. Okay, so one of the tokens is over there. Let's keep looting. Oh, oh, baby, insulation boost. Thank you so much. This is this is what I wanted. All right, actually, I think since I had gotta head back over there anyways, uh, and grab you know get the stairs. Okay, say so of course three codes are distributed over the Titan, one in each wreckage. No doubt, of course. No, it wouldn't be all in the same place. I mean, they gotta make me move around, run around, and do some silly tasks. Which I will, you know, I will gladly do. I don't mind, really. Um, where's my, did I, I think I left my EVA boost all the way over there. Boo. So, the console is over there. You know, let's jump on the other side. Probably find some good loot around here also. Anything here? No? No? Up we go. Okay, so I'm gonna do the bottom area first. Gonna loot the crap out of these rooms. If there is anything to loot, of course. Mm hmm. So far, so good. Absolutely nothing. Sure. Okay. Well, I do have these containers here. Just gonna empty those. Okay, let's run back this way and go upstairs. Right here. Oh, let's go to the token console and just pick up our updating token code module. Start procedure. Hidden log file detected. Play file? Sure. Command meeting room. T-230213 Admiral Yaden. Vice Admiral Benner. Commander Mercer. Hello, Mr. Mercer. The council is setting you uh, over for another last minute stress test. Admiral, Vice Admiral. Please have a seat, Mercer. Thanks, Vice Admiral. So, why are we meeting here? Has the start postponed again? No, sir. The opposite has happened. The scheduled start has been set up to 1600 tomorrow. What? Mercer, can you please tell the council that is at least 24 hours too early? The warp drives are not ready, not to mention all the other stuff that is missing. I'm afraid the countdown is already started. The other commanders will be informed in an hour about the new schedule. I check the status of all the ships. We should be ready even for this accelerated schedule. I just checked the new mission parameters. All shores leaves have been cancelled. The personnel on the pollen station 
Titan Station and the Marine bases will be sent to the transport in the next 12 hours. Seems there is no way back, hmm? Nope. The time window of the event is set and will be open for, for only a minute. Perhaps less. Okay. Then, so be it. We knew this could happen. Mr. Benner, please commence the start protocols. Aye, sir. Mr. Mercer, we have installed the control station you requested. It is locked with your credentials. Thanks, sir. There. Condition yellow at 10 tomorrow morning. Affirmative, sir. Okay, gentlemen, let's add a new chapter to mankind's history. Wonderful. Token code module sequence one updated. Two more files required to full override code reconstruction. All right, thank you. So it's going to be time to head over to the middle. But first, I just want to see what's in here. Huh? Any any other goodies? Yeah, I want loot. Okay, we got these wardrobes with guns. I'll take it. Thank you. Uh huh. Yeah. And uh, a very non-private and cold bathroom. <laughs> no, thank you. I'm not taking a shower in there for sure. So let's move to the midsection and, uh, you know, just uh, get more jaw cramps from all this reading. Okay, thrusters on. Move. Okay, and... No, no, that's not it. This is that way. That way. Yeah, so this is the middle section, and it appears my turrets picked up on something. So, more goods to loot here. But uh, I think these things might not have a core. Can I? Can I just uh, loot it? Or, you know, retrieve some resources from the the main uh, items. You know what? Let's grab the fuels. So, Xyrex were here and they didn't even, you know, loot the fuel from these things. Yeah? They left it for me. How kind. Okay. Let's grab the oxygen. Little console. These doors. Might as well grab those. Give me a little bit of resources. And this one here. Open the door. Okay, I can climb up here. I I said I can climb up here. Thank you. No. <laughs> Come on, it's just a little jump. How hard can it be? No, oh, these windows are good to give uh, Sathia. So, oh, another one of these. Okay. Let's just, uh, yeah, let's not do this one, though. Updating token code module start procedures. Attention. Another hidden log file was detected. Play file? <laughs> if you must, it's my pleasure. Mission planning room. T minus eight. Meh, meh, meh. Commander Lamar. Lieutenant Commander Zerogen. Jennifer, did your team already set up the rework warp cage for the new schedule? These guys are crazy rescheduling the start to 24 hours earlier. Uh, they literally threw me out of my bed in the middle of the night, but yes, we managed to get this done just a few minutes before your arrival. Hey, before I forget, there is a new guy on the bridge. Mercer, Mincer, Mince, Mur, blah, blah, blah. Not exactly sure. Black suit, spooky guy. Hmm. I sense some trouble. The whole project has gone a strange route. Do you remember when we were college students? When the first team started after Hyperion was lost, analyze the incident. Build a new science vessel. We can do it better. Blah, blah. All those pathetic speeches. We had a test about the Hyperion incident and what followed uh, from it in our science class in college. If I would have known that after I signed up five years ago, that they are building a fleet with only two functional warp drives, I would have taken it from uh, an April for an April Fool's joke. Absolutely. And why do we need those turrets and even combat ships and marines and fighters for a warp drive test and resource gathering in Proxima Centauri? 
feels more like the Admiral wants to invade a solar system. Like in the old Star Combat movies we watched last week. You can say Star Wars, okay? Star Wars! Or Star Trek, whatever. If, the, <laughs> if it's like that, <laughs> I'd better get some sleep. May the thought be with you. Ah, send your coll colleagues to the cabin as well. You and your team have achieved something next to impossible in the given time frame. I'll check the settings with the AI in the next few hours. Good night. Yeah. Can you please try to sync the incoming waves with the modules to 0 0.2? We should try to minimize any signal loop or any external disturbance will make this whole thing either a giant heater or an uncomfortable wave skimmer. Of course, Commander. Adjustments are in the works. Token module sequence 2 updated. One more file required to full override code reconstruction. Okay, let's find the rear. I want to go in the rear. Oh, ooh. Hello. Hello, golems. Don't mind if I, uh, you know, just gather your resources, huh? Ooh, one down. And... Oh, this one's a little tougher. Wow. Okay, I guess that uh, you are a low-level golem, so no surprise there. Okay, uh, that's that's very lovable goodies. Ores and resources that are sometimes hard to come by. Let's just transfer those, though. Don't want to keep them on my person. So these I won't, I don't want to land because I, I think there will be a drone attack and I want this sucker ready closer. Yeah, that's better. That's much better. I want the Wi-Fi range. So we're going up the rear. I know, I just sound gross. Mm-hmm, <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm More guns and loots. Ooh, medicine. Awesome. I always use more medicine. Ooh, we're in the the guts of the beast. Hey, hey, hey! Wasn't done with you. Okay, let's not fall down this hole. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, just normal goodies. Fine, I'll go back down here. And, uh, you know, keep exploring and looting. Can I can I go up there, maybe? No, okay, there doesn't seem to be anything behind. All right, oh, hello, door. Mm-hmm, decorations. Okay, nothing of, uh, of value here. Let's go up again. Oh. Ooh, this looks like a nice bridge. Oh, so there is our token console. Let's go for it. Eh, a drill. And I shall sell you. Ooh, medium armor and an armor boost. Me likey. Updating token code module. Let me guess, you got some hidden message? Attential. <laughs> New hidden log file has been detected. Play file? Yes! Yes, I was looking forward to this. Warp core control room. T minus five hours, blah, blah, blah. Commander Lamar, Commander Mercer. Hello, Commander Lamar. Oh, hello, Commander Mercer. Nice to have you here. I've heard you are now responsible for the warp engines and the protocols. And for having overwritten my repair protocols and test the moment you stepped on board the Titan. So, how can I help you? I'm just having a look at the warp core. Impressive. Un yes, unbelievable. What the techs have pulled out of that junk pile in Antarctica four decades ago. Nothing but destroyed devices and incompleted blueprints. But now, somehow, it just magically works. You know what that means. Yes, indeed. Just a question, if you don't mind. What exactly are you doing here? As I said, having a look at the warp core and its optimizations. Hmm, okay. 
then enjoy your stay. I am setting up the final routines. Or do you want to rewrite them right away? No worries. It seems there have been no issues with the schedule being moved forward, yes? Uh... <clears throat> no. Sure. The teams have made exceptional progress since the office sitter decided to throw them out of their bed. Uh, this after already working weeks with nearly no sleep. That's obvious, the risk of working in the expedition fleet, right? Aha! Uh -huh. Tell you what, this whole expedition thing is going to a strange route. Uh, not to mention, there's a council that governs all the decision and the UCH is somehow in the dark. Don't you think it this requires some additional explanation? No, what, sh what should we explain? To whom? There is nothing secret about the expedition. For those that are involved, well, there's the people that they need to know. Yes, that's exactly my point. As you might know, my grandpa was the lead engineer on the Hyperion. He was not lost with the ship only for your for one simple reason. Someone decided to reschedule his shift. I'm thankful for that, but my grandpa never managed to get rid of the stigma of the coward that was left behind. My dad moved to Mars with me after my grandpa's sudden death. I signed up for the fleet right after college to show what our family is capable of. My dad said that grandpa became crazy about this shit. The pretending the officials just want to silence everyone, especially him personally, and the Hyperion bereaved organization. All his stories of a planned accident, the ship not being destroyed, and some threat we are facing, all very dramatic. And to be honest, until the last 24 hours, I always thought this old poor man simply could not cope with what happened. When you showed up on board the Titan, I suddenly remembered one of my grandpa's stories about some black suit visiting Hyperion a few days ahead of the mission. Commander, please, tell you what. I've been working for this project for nearly eight years now, and in these last few months, I've looked at this project and have done the math. In the last week, and in the last 24 hours in particular, so many strange things have happened. The Grand and the Titan each have several squads of Marines on board. I checked the manifest yesterday. We have stashed away tons and tons of high caliber ammo. I'm an engineer. I know what these formulas and materials are made for. This is not for asteroid defense. And now you are coming on board and the first thing you do is mess around with the protocols I have been developing for the last five years. The adjustments were made are coming directly from Apollon Labs. Dr. Grayson and Dr. Dawson? I know them. But I have also looked at the changes you made. They are risky. I'm not sure that they would they should do exactly. They don't seem to have any function that improves the efficiency on the warp drive. Rest assured, these have been approved by top specialists. Everything is fine. Rest assured, if something goes wrong and if someone is harmed, and I discovered that it was all because of your changes, nothing will be fine for you. Token Co module sequence 3 updated. Confirm to complete the sequence. Confirm. Alas, another long text read. <laughs> ah, so, now off to the bridge. So much reading. I wasn't expecting all this. All right, let's look around here. Elude the crap out of the rest of this place. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Nothing here. Oh, there seems to be a container or two over there. Open the door. Anything else in this area? Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. Computer stuff. Shigermabob. Nothing of use. Okay, laser rifle. Fine, I'll sell that. Can get a couple of a uh, thousand bucks for that. Oh, yeah. Even my guy's hungry now. So. Let's heat an emergency ration. Let's do this. Okay, anything here? Is this a bridge? I highly doubt it. Doesn't look like it. Let's go up more. Oh, command console. 
Okay, anything I can loot before? Let's get this out and fully loaded because I think there's going to be a battle. Commando con code reassemble. Override code black accepted. Gra access granted. Updating Wave Rider database. IDA service reinitializing. It's about time! Hello, Commander. You managed to reactivate my system, and I might owe you some explanations. I'm afraid there's a little information that relates to our issues on Apollon Station and our voyage that I was not able to reveal to you. So, really? I am afraid I am still partially blocked from some important files by the remains of the Waverider protocol. But thanks to you, retrieving the code sequence code BLACK, I am now able to remove the digital seals. What I can say after having analyzed just the raw data I can now access, this whole transport uh, to Andromeda did not happen by accident. That would be quite disturbing. You are right. It should be impossible to have foreseen the complex uh, sequence of events up to this point. I have no answer for that, Commander. However, with the new data, I have further analyzed our current situation. Please summarize this mess. And when I say summarize, summarize, please. This whole operation seems to have had totally different goals than the one the team were told. The official story was we would be going on a short trip to Proxima Centauri to get more Pentaxa to help Earth survive. The fleet left the Jupiter orbit forced by the Wave Rider protocol, as it seems, and ended up billions of light years beyond that point in Andromeda. The irregular vortex we were dragged into might have been the reason for the passage to Andromeda, a wavefront which pushed us further than the warp drive could ever have achieved alone. It seems like this was uh, finally planned up to the very second, although I'm not sure if our little one-year delay was planned as well or just an accident either. Anyways, as far as we know, the fleet was attacked immediately upon arrival, which makes me think those Xyrex were waiting for them. Or they simply ended up in a galactic coordinates nest, where everyone is pretty nervous. Shoot first, ask later. Well, I agree, Xyrex scum. Of course I'd shoot him first. Similar things might have happened before. Not sure if the Councils knew about that, but they armed the fleet as much as possible. A risk that probably did not pay out? Probably. I found the last available bridge protocol. It is partially destroyed, though. July 26, 2473, Admiral Benner and Commander Mercer. Sir. We can't wait any longer. The unknown enemy is amassing more and more ships. We've already lost two transport and the Titan will not stand a chance. Please get to the shuttle. Mercer, this is not your command. Get out of here and take Yadin with you. Still must investigate the anomaly we found when entering this system. I will report to Admiral Perez on the ground. How shall we? Loud explosion. Log damage. Boom, bam, bam, beam. This is Admiral Benner. All personnel, abandon ship! I repeat, abandon ship! The Titan is lost! All personnel, go to the rescue pods! The Grand is th and the rest of the fleet will warp out any minutes. I rep- Here, yeah. make contact to the Grand. Our tr uh, transceiver is damaged. We can send only, Vice Admiral. Contact established. Perez, listen. I don't have a lot of time left. We are pulling the enemies away from you. We have the... Uh, no, well, a planetary remnant. The wavefront originated from here. We need to stay away from... End of message. At least something. <laughs> At least we know most of the fleet survived and retreated to an undisclosed location. Dead end for now? Not necessarily. Although that hidden subroutine knocked me out, the suit subsystems will still gather information. It seems like the long-range antenna array of this wreckage is still working. If I can power them for just a few minutes, I we could send an emergency broadcast. But this would mean the Xyrax would send everything they have at this position. Given the military site nearby, this will leave you with only a few moments to get prepared for them. F. Yeah. 
Better fight them with your vessel than on foot. Either way, you need to keep the troops busy for only a few minutes until the antenna completes sending the signal. Lock and load! Alright, so where's my ship? Where is it? Ah! Falling! Ah! Falling! Again! <laughs> Let's get out of here. Let's find my ship. Where did I leave it? If I'm not mistaken, I left my ship. Why doesn't it show on my map? Okay. Well, my ship is already taking care of business. Oh, we got these fast little buggers. All right, all right, come on, ship. Uh, help, come on, jump. No! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Damn it. Ah, uh, come on. <laughs> Jetpack. Okay, wait a second. Yeah, let's back off. Let's take care of business. Down you go. Come on, bombers. There's another rocket. Let's destroy him. <laughs> I've marked a location on your map and on your radar. Cool. Oh, oh, oh. I see bombs coming. Yeah, let's let... Let's take care of the rest of these guys. And we can go loot. Yeah, maybe it'll go better if I go in uh, first-person view. Ah, stop running and face me like a man. Or like a Xyrax. Oh, that was a cute maneuver. Ah, down, boy. Oh, my God. They, they are tough as hell. Ah, you know, I'm going to be wasting all my bullets on these guys, so... You know what? Let's get out of here. Let's go to the comms array. Ladies and gentlemen, that'll be all for today. If you liked today's video, don't forget to nudge that little like button. And also, let me know if you have any comments. Take care, stay safe, Rakuna out.